In her investigation, Femi was using universal indicator. And this is a mix of a number of different indicators, and it's particularly good because of the range of colours it produces. If I put universal indicator in orange juice, it turns slightly red. But if I put it into lemon juice, it turns very red. And this means the lemon juice is more acidic than orange juice. Now, if I try these experiments on lots of different substances, I end up with all these colours, from the very red at one end to the very blue at the other end. But is the dark red, the very acidic, stronger than the dark blue, the very alkaline? Well, let's see, shall we, with the help of these two volunteers. Now, I've got to be very careful here. This dark red is sulfuric acid, and this is what it does to Kevin when concentrated. Not very nice. But look, this dark blue, caustic soda, is very alkaline, and look what it does to Kevin's brother when concentrated. Just as nasty. So, both are very strong, but in different ways. So maybe it's better if we look at our scale of colours like this. If we number them from 1 for a strong acid to 14 for a strong alkali, with 7 in the middle meaning neutral, neither acid or alkali, then we have a scale known as the pH scale. And the pH scale is how acidity and alkalinity are measured in scientific terms.